Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to show you how you can take a free printable that you find online and put it into your digital planner. What did I do with my pen? Time out. Okay. So, let me show you what I'm talking about. Go away. Okay. So, I all the time am finding free printables online that I want to use um, for planning and just for all kinds of different things. So, I found one. Okay, here it is. I found this habit tracker on Pinterest. It was a free printable, but I didn't want to print it out. I wanted to have it and put it just like this in my digital planner. So I was trying to figure out a way to do it and I figured it out. So I thought I would share it with you guys because I'm sure I'm not the only person who's been like, oh, that's so cute. I wish I could use it in my digital planner. Now these are like landscape so and I didn't want to have them sideways so I just made them small but like vertical printables would be perfect for this um okay so basically I downloaded the printable off of the blog or website that I got it from I'll link that down below I'll go back and find her so you can download that habit tracker if you want and I just downloaded it into my files on my iPad. I apologize if you hear banging. A neighbor a couple of houses down is having like some construction or something. They started it at like seven o'clock this morning. <laughs> so, um, okay. But I downloaded it on my, my iPad and I was like, okay, how do I get this PDF into my digital planner? Like I was trying a lot of different things and it just wasn't doing what I wanted. So what I did was I just copied this PDF into GoodNotes. Okay, and I did create new document. Now, since I could not figure out how to put a PDF into my digital planner, I went over here to options in GoodNotes, did export, current page, and make sure your format is image. Now, I haven't tried to do this yet, and I'm curious if you could make it transparent. Um, I'm gonna have to try that and see. But I just did normal because my pages are white, the background of this is white, it's fine. But as long as it's an image, you can export it. And then I just did save to camera roll. So then I could come over here Add image from photos and it's right there. You can see it where I did it the other day and then today. And it will pop it right into your planner. You can size it however you want and you're good to go to use it. So yeah, I just wanted to share that. Just a quick tip on how to put a PDF into your digital planner in GoodNotes. Um, this really opens up like endless possibilities for things you can add to your planner because there are so many cute printables online and you can, you know, just pop them right in. There's also printables you can buy on Etsy, like what I have in my shop. Um, just all kinds of stuff that you can add. And you know, I knew I had to do an image, but now I can add a PDF too. So I thought that was really cool. If you find this helpful, Give it a thumbs up. I'd love to have you subscribe for more planner videos and I will see you in my next one. Bye.